allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome to Fight Club, fellas. Rule number one, we don't talk about Fight Club. Rule number two, we don't talk about Fight Club. Third rule of Fight Club, someone yells stop, goes limp, taps out, the fight is over. Fourth rule, only two guys fight at a time. Let the fight begin. Good morning, Mona Shores. These are your daily announcements for Friday, May 11th, 2018. I'm Chuck. I'm Chris. Please remember the May Challenge Sailor Pride Day incentive, 10% reduction in referrals for underclassmen in May. If we meet this 10% reduction at the end of the day on June 8th, we will have fun with a field day type activity with staff and students in our stadium. Individual incentive, students with zero tardies and zero tech referrals in May will be entered into a drawing for a prize. Student Senate has planned a Spirit Week next week for seniors to celebrate their last couple weeks of school. On Monday, it's Beach Day. Tuesday, Greasers vs. Preps. Wednesday, Senior Citizen Day. Throwback Thursday. Then Friday, Superhero Day. These Spirit Days are for seniors only. Today in History in 1942, Go Down Moses by William Faulkner is published. Also today in History, Bob Marley passed away. And Western writer Mari Sandoz was born. This is Sailor Country. We do everything with pride. Against a regional opponent, the tennis team took Lowell and won 5-3. Big wins were put out by one doubles, Mikhail Lieb and Riley Trigstead. And four singles, Journey Fett. Three doubles, Jackie Porowski and Gabby Alderman earned a convincing win. Four doubles, Emily Lieb and Mikhail Sander fought hard. Maggie DeYoung at one singles faced off against a very talented player. And Paige Justin was even before retiring the second set. Two doubles didn't let the Red Arrow team get a game in their second set, and Sophie Shirley at two singles won the, with ease. Next step for the Sailors will be the conference tournament where they hope to make a big statement. Let's go, ladies. JV Soccer won over Fruitport 6-0. Scoring for the Sailors was Camille Zudema, Sarah Gappa, Maddie Ogle, Riley Rosenthal, Annie Anderson, and Danielle Eggleton. Morgan Henson, Maya Wren, Brooke LaRue, and Gappa added assists. A strong defensive unit of Sydney Fetters, Maya Bowers, Kennedy McCombs, Brooke Wilkes, Chloe Maxwell, and Megan Quigg ensured Gabby Lopez gained another shutout. Varsity Soccer beat Fruitport last night 4-1. Scoring for the Sailors was Nora Brown with two. Mika Hart and Sarah Mikesell. Assists came from Sarah Mikesell three times and Peyton Ertman. Luxon Must made eight saves to help the Sailors preserve the win. Great overall play came from Emily Carlson and Peyton Ertman. Varsity softball split a doubleheader with Forest Hills Central. In Game 1, the Sailors fell 20-5 in five innings. Riley Whaler was 2-for-3 and Taylor Dew was 1-for-2 with a solo home run. In Game 2, the Sailors rallied for eight runs in the top of the seventh to win 9-5. Lauren Patterson picked up the win. Veronica Kostelik led the offensive, going 3-for-4 with two home runs, including a grand slam in the seventh that put the Sailors up for good. Maddie Mettler added a two-run home run in the seventh. The Sailors are now 14-10 and 10 on the season and 5-1 and one in the conference. JV Baseball swept you in a doubleheader by a combined score of 35 to nothing. Five pitchers combined for no-hitters in both games. Varsity Baseball completed the three-game sweep of Union with an 11-1 mercy. Connor Bellinger went five innings, allowing no earned runs, striking out seven and walking none. Austin Flowers had two doubles, two RBIs, two runs scored, and two stolen bases. Matt Martin had two hits, three runs scored, and three stolen bases. Tyler Warren and Andrew Moss added two hits apiece. The Sailors improved to 17-5 overall and 8-1 in the conference. Today in sports, freshman baseball host Greenville with a doubleheader. Girls lacrosse travels to Jenison and boys lacrosse travels to Comstock Park. Tomorrow, varsity tennis hosts the conference tournament. JV baseball travels to a tournament at Grand Haven. Varsity softball travels to a tournament at Hudsonville. And soccer teams travel to Grand Haven. Uh uh, eat healthy foods, abide by the food pyramid. Um, 
Should we get good grades? Yes. That's all we have for you today, sailors. Have a funky Friday. Constriction. I'm gonna be freaking.